20,000 people drive Interstate 40 every day. It is a busy interstate and officers patrol it for speeders. Yeah, there was a concerning situation yesterday on I-40 in Alamance County. A woman says a driver tried to pull her over, but WFM News 2's Hannah Jeffries found out it wasn't an officer behind those flashing lights. That's right, guys. Graham police told me about a situation that happened along I-40 yesterday. The woman told officers she had just left Mebane when a car started following her, trying to pull her over. Here's a picture of that car from police, a white Kia with California plates. The woman told police it was following her, tailgating, swerving, and trying to make her stop. The woman also says the Kia's driver was waving a badge. Graham police captain Tony Velez said as the last time he heard of a situation like this was about a year ago. It's happened before, unfortunately. We've heard of this. I've been doing this job for 23 years, so it's not my first time hearing of something like this. But uh, it, it's slightly alarming. I understand it's very alarming for the public to, to worry about somebody impersonating one of us. And get this, police say the Kia was also flashing green lights. Generally speaking, green lights are on uh, like security personnel, like at the hospital, or, uh, private security. So that's not something that police officers do and, and security officers don't have the authority to pull people over on public streets. So and that's what we want to remind the public of, just be mindful. Police say the woman was not hurt and the Kia driver eventually drove off towards Greensboro. Now here's the thing. If you are pulled over in Graham, it'll probably be by one of the following cars. You have your typical cop car, a Crown Victoria, Tahoe or a Charger, and you most likely won't get pulled over by a Kia.